Have you ever thought how internet works? Whenever you upload a photo video on any social media website or any messenger app, it travels around the world within seconds. Within seconds. I've asked few people including people from the networking background to check their understanding on internet and I got different answers altogether. Most of them think that for example, if we upload a photo on Facebook, it goes to the Facebook server through satellite and then people can access the data from the Facebook server directly. It doesn't happen like this, man. Hey guys, this is Tarun from Gather and Plugged and today I'm going to tell you how internet works. So here's the thing, 99% of the internet relies on high fiber optic cables also known as submarine cables. Only 1% of the internet runs through satellite for weather forecast and location tracing. So let's understand this entire thing, how this entire internet works. Basically there are three types of ISP, tier 1 ISP, tier 2 ISP and tier 3 ISP. Tier 1 ISPs are those who are the biggest around the world. They don't have to pay anything to anyone for internet. They provide internet to others like tier 2 and tier 3 ISPs. They have global uh, connection around the world and they can access any other tier 1 network without paying any fees. They invest their money on submarine cables connecting one country to another country. Tier 2 ISPs which have regional connection and they have to pay a fee to access tier 1 network. Mostly companies are Airtel, Vodafone and IDEA etc. Then tier 3 ISPs. If you've heard about local internet service providers, for example, Tikona Internet, Hathway, uh, any network or Spectrum and so on. They are tier 3 ISPs. They have to pay tier 2 ISPs to access their internet. They provide internet uh, in a particular uh, locality, in a particular city, apartment, colonies. So tier 1 networks who connect globally, tier 2 networks who have regional connection and tier 3 networks uh, are those who provide you internet locally. You know more about how submarine cables are connected. You can check out this website submarinecablesmap.com. Here you can see how submarine cables are connected to each country to provide you internet. If you like this video, please hit like. If you want to share your feedback, please write on the comment box. If you, if you think that this video is helpful, please share as much as you can and please subscribe to Gadget Unplugged for more updates like this.